Uh, hi, uh, my name is Shinzo, and uh, I'm working at uh, the Texas A&M Agri Life Research uh, at Beaumont. This year, we had uh, uh, heavy, uh, heavier, severe outbreaks of uh, bacterial pen uh, blight in rice in Texas, and this disease uh, took place almost uh, 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 across all the Texas rice belt. And this disease occurred West Houston and uh, also East Houston. And uh, this disease is caused by the bacterial pathogen. And so far, uh, this disease is really is a concern to our rice industry because we have really limited the means to control this disease. And right now, we don't have any higher level uh, levels of uh, uh, resistance in cultivars, and also we don't have any chemical uh, effect to control this disease. So this is really a concern. And um, in addition to this year, in, two, in 1995, we all also had a very severe of this disease. So, so, so uh, right now, uh, uh, at the Beaumont Research Center, uh, in collaboration with the Department of the Plant Pathology and uh, Microbiology. We are trying to develop uh, biocontrol measures for control of this severe disease in Texas. So here we are show some of the uh, pathogens. Maybe this is a plate and uh, it's growing with the bacterial pathogen. Maybe you can see the yellow pigmentation this is uh, one of typical of the um, pathogen. The pathogen produces the pigmentation. And, uh, and also, these several plates we show this, uh, we only, uh, got some of the bi-control bacterial isolates, which uh, were proved to, af uh, to be effective for, sub uh, f for suppression of the bacterial pathogen. So right now, we have done some of work in the lab, greenhouse, and for this year we also did some uh, field trials, trying to develop a new biocontrol strategies for control of these diseases.